Hey guys, Agamer1 here, and today I'm doing my first ever Minecraft video. And uh, I know a lot of my subscribers have been asking me to do this for quite a few months now, and I finally bought Minecraft about two weeks ago, and uh, I've been getting into it quite a bit actually. <clears throat> and uh, this Minecraft series is going to be two things. First of all, it's going to be a tutorial series, where for my first 10 or 20 videos I'm going to go basically through the basics of this game. Uh, those include things like surviving your first night in Minecraft, building weapons and armor, uh, collecting resources like coal, iron ore, uh, mining itself, animals, uh, building houses, etc. like that. And then once I've done some tutorial videos, I'm going to move on to some Let's Plays. And that'll be kind of showing you guys what I've made in my main worlds of Minecraft. And uh, I may also let you guys set me things to build. And uh, if I do build it correctly to your standard of have you want it, I may do some giveaways for you guys um, just to have some stuff. So, today we are going to look at uh, basically surviving your first night in Minecraft. Now, to do this, we're going to go into single player. And uh, these are some main worlds I've already got here, but for the sakes of the series, we're going to make a new world and we're going to call it just YouTube. Right there. I'm doing survival, which means basically we start off with nothing, we have to do our own find our own stuff, we have to make our own resources, craft our own things, gain levels and uh, definitely watch your health and hunger bar, those are very important. Um, if you're new to Minecraft or haven't got it yet, um, when you make a new world there is this option here called more world options and uh, this seed generator here, you can type things in like caves and mountains say and these are kind of uh, things that should appear in your world at some point but uh, I'm gonna leave that blank for now anyway but uh, if you want to add like any kind of keywords like rivers or stuff then feel free and go ahead but uh, we're just going to quickly go and create the new world and uh, anything I do on this uh, world guys will be strictly for YouTube so I will not edit this world unless it's going to be in a video so uh, you guys don't miss a thing and uh, we're saving chunks okay so we've just spawned appears to be near a lake we've got a bit of a forest over here and it's like could be a bit of a desert over there as well. So, the first thing we need is to get some wood. So, um, wood can be used for a number of things. It's mainly used for your first couple of weapons. Um, you can use it for other things as well, like making torches and planks of wood, which I'm going to show you uh, in the next few minutes of this video. But first of all, I'd recommend collecting about 10 to 15 pieces of wood to get started. Now. Um, this may take a couple of minutes, depending on how many trees are around you when you spawn. I should be able to get another five from this tree over here, hopefully. And uh, with the wood, like I said, you can make other things. And uh, I'm going to show you that in just a second. But uh, when you spawn in your world, you want to make sure you have um, a decent kind of place to set up your first house. Now, your house hasn't got to be anything special, it can just be a place in a cave and I would definitely suggest finding a cave and camping out for the night because all you want to do on your first night is survive and you know if you die a couple of times don't worry people die all the time in their first day because they're just really confused on what to do and uh, how to make stuff so right now I have 10 pieces of wood I'm just wandering around quickly uh, see if there's anywhere decent like any caves or anything I could it's already there, I could kind of half start building in. Um, if I don't find any caves, I may just go and dig a hole somewhere. And uh, sit in there, I think there's a cave over there by the looks of things. Yep, there's a cave there, I believe. Uh, it's a bit big, but we can also make that smaller. There's a nice waterfall there as well. That's quite a cool map, actually. Quite a good map. We've got some sheep over there as well. And, oh yes, we have iron ore. Okay, guys. Now, um, creepers or skeletons say could spawn in this area and they will spawn in any dark place so right out here it's light time so nothing will come out nothing should come and kill me out here but uh, if I go too deep say into there or down here then I may get spawned on so I'm going to use this area as my first uh, initial base for my first house so we have some wood and what I'm going to quickly do is go into my inventory now this is my dude here, and this bit down here is like my hotbar kind of thing with all my tools and stuff. So if I take these bits of wood now and put them all in here, um, one block of wood will convert these into four wooden planks. So I'm going to take all of these just by clicking left all the time, and there you go, all my wood is now converted into planks. And now if I 
uh, put them all there, and then right click, it will divide them equally. They've got 20 and 20. Now, uh, one of these, no, two of these wooden planks will make four sticks. So I'm going to make about 30, 40 sticks, that's what I'll do, 40 sticks. And put them back together. So now, make a crafting table, and a crafting table is basically that you make more things like weapons and armor. So I'm going to right click once in each of these squares, and there is your crafting table. So I'm just going to place, place all these down in my hot bar area, because I'm going to be using these a lot. And right there is a zombie, and oh god, oh god, Jesus, I haven't, oh, he's on fire, That that's not healthy. Um, protect me sheep, it is going wrong. That's what I mean by they can spawn near you. Um, I haven't got anything to hit him with. I can just... Oh, come on. I will kill you. Eat my crafting table, damn you. Ah. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> That's what I mean by uh, unsuspected visits. Um, they will spawn in dark places and they will come out of here. So I need to quickly build that back up. But, um, yeah, I was getting a bit distracted. So now, we have a crafting table the fuck? God's sake, that shouldn't have happened either. This is going so wrong for my first video of Minecraft. There we go. Okay. Let's put it here so I can actually see what's going on. Okay. So, uh, what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to make a pickaxe, and that can be used to mine certain things like coal, which we're going to need. So if I just right-click once there and once there, uh, this is like the handle of my pickaxe, so really you want to make, um, you want to basically build, um, the shape of what it is you're trying to create. So now I'm going to put one, two, and three, and right there we have a pickaxe. It's a wooden pickaxe. Now uh, it may not last very long, but it will let you let you mine stuff like cobblestone. And uh, we need cobblestone because we need to make a stone pickaxe, and that will be able to let us let us uh, mine this coal over here. And we need coal mainly for making light to keep the dark places lit up from all of the bad people in this game. So I'm just going to get a bit more cobblestone here, like so, and yeah, okay. So, what I'm going to do now is make a stone pickaxe, and this will last a lot longer than wood, and also it'll let you get more resources as well, so there we go, and we have a stone pickaxe. Now with this, I'm going to quickly mine this coal. This is all coal here, this black marking, you can tell what's coal. Oh, that's the wrong one, sorry. There you go, there's a stone one. So I'm going to get a, as much as I probably can uh, of, of coal. It is a very valuable resource, you can use it in things like furnaces and uh, keeping things alight. And it can be, it's not rare, but it can be sometimes hard to find stuff if you're in a bit of a hurry like I am right now. So I'm just going to get all this coal here, and that should do. Okay, now as you saw that zombie spawned down here in the very dark pit of doom, and uh, what I'm going to do, I've got some lava there as well, but uh, I'm going to stay in this area here next to these sheep and stuff. So, once I have filled this part in a little bit, my own little kind of enclosed area, we need to keep it light so anything bad doesn't spawn on us in the dark. So, um, I'm just going to quickly uh, get some wood. I should probably punch wood, actually. Um, not wood, I'm sorry, dirt to be quicker to punch dirt. Now, um, dirt isn't the best thing to use for your first shower, but if you're in a bit of a hole like I am, it's going to get dark soon, and that's when all the creepers are going to come out and try and kill me and zombies and stuff. So, uh, for now, I'm just going to make a very quick shelter. And it's all you've got to do on your first night, just do stuff really quickly. Don't do anything fancy, because you're not going to have the resources, you're not going to have the time to do it either. So, uh, I'm going to just get as much dirt as I can. Um, I won't make my thing very big, giggity. I won't make my shower that big, actually, but uh, enough to just stay inside of. So, um, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to have this bit here as the side of my kind of den and it's going to put some oh god dirt down here and this area here is going to be my little kind of hidey hole cave area and uh, it should hopefully keep me oh, protected for the night and uh, just put it across here ok 
Okay. Like so. And uh, we'll just quickly make a roof. Because uh, you don't want any bad guys to drop down on you. Uh, I know right now they probably wouldn't do, but they might be able to come off of here and somehow get in my base. So, uh, make a roof, definitely. And uh, a little hidey hole so you can see when it is night time outside. Uh, and then also you can see if any enemies are near you and other things like that. So I'm just getting a bit more mud here, a bit more dirt. And uh, just gonna just gonna make the roof for my base right here. That should be enough, I hope, to not get eaten. Because I really don't want to get eaten tonight. I would like to live for my first night in Minecraft. And I uh, think I'm still gonna need some more dirt, guys. So bear with me. It can be very time-consuming this game. Um, what feels like half an hour could be three hours of gameplay. It does get addictive and it does go fairly quick. Especially when you're like on the edge of trying to build something in a hurry against the clock. Uh, things time just go very quickly. Let's get a bit more dirt here, about 12 pieces. That should be enough. So as you can see here, I'm just going to fill in this area so no one can drop down and get me. It's my front door here, and uh, I'm just going to do that right now. I've made myself a little kind of shelter, and I believe it's going to get dark pretty damn soon. So. Just gonna bash my way through my crafting table here and pick it back up, and then I'm just gonna plonk it back down uh, in my shelter. Put it there. Now, uh, it's important to have a door, really, or some sort of hidey hole. Um, for a door, you're gonna need some wooden planks again, and what you need to do that is just put six, like so. Four, five, and six. That's your front door there put it down here and basically put the 7 key and boom you got a front door now as it's going to get dark outside this is where things can spawn in here if it's pitch black so before it does get dark we need to quickly uh, get make ourselves some torches now first you need just one stick here and coal so I'm just going to do that and I'll get four torches from one stick and one bit of coal so I'm going to make about 24 torches Oop, just threw it all away <laughs> Got it back up. Okay. So it's getting dark out very quickly if I press the three button here and quickly place these torches in my den, like so. And now nothing nasty can spawn in my hidey hole. As you can see, guys, just have a quick look outside. It's getting dark. It's nearly pitch black outside. And this is the time now where you want to hide in your cave or your little hut or your shelter for the night and uh, wait for morning and uh, come back the next day. So, uh, hope you guys have enjoyed my first Minecraft video. Um, if you found it helpful, give it a thumbs up. And of course, I'll keep making them if you enjoy the video itself. Um, as I said, this has been your first uh, day or, and night to survive in Minecraft. And uh, episode two, I will go on to show you how to start making your actual house and finding good resources and stuff like that. So, um, all I'm going to do right now is just sit here, look out my doorway and uh, wait for the morning to come and then I'll come back out on the, wo on the road of Minecraft and uh, do some more mining. So I hope you guys have enjoyed, thank you for watching and uh, I will see you all in the next video. Peace out guys.